Hi guys, and Merry Christmas. Today is, well, Boxing Day, I guess, in the English-speaking world. It's the day after Christmas Eve. And uh, in Norway, we celebrate on Christmas Day, so I'm a little bit slow on this, I guess. But I asked you guys on Instagram if you wanted to see a, um, like, what I got for Christmas type video, and the majority of you said yes. I only have no one no so far. So I figured I'd just get it. And um, we actually, I think, got everything that we wished for this year. And I forgot one thing over here. <laughs> All right, we wreck. So I'm not gonna say anything about who we got the presents from or anything like that because it doesn't matter. This is just if you were curious what I got for Christmas. And I also do want to mention that Marius and I do not exchange Christmas gifts. So if you're curious what I got from him or what he got from me, the answer is nothing. We didn't get each other anything. So I just wanted to clear that out. So I am just going to get started. I guess we can just get started with the bigger things because I can get them out of the way. So the first like big thing we got is this inflatable mattress. And this is 150 wide. So this is going to be like our guest bed because we don't have a room that's big enough to have an actual extra bed in. So now we can just put this behind the couch and we can have a little, um, like we can have guests sleep over there. So this is great. And then another thing that we asked for is a new waffle iron. We had one before, but the waffles, they are so thin that they're basically crackers. They are like super, super hard when they come out. So we asked for a new one and this is what Norwegian waffle irons look like. They're not like the wide Belgian ones, but smaller with heart shaped waffles. So there are five extra big deep hearts, uh, well five per waffle, and then they're 18 centimeters in diameter for each of these round ones. So uh, we got this one and I'm super excited. Now we can invite our family over for waffles. The last bigger thing that we got, which is ob ob honestly more for me, and this is a combined Christmas present and birthday present as my birthday is in January. And uh, this is something that I wanted, and if you have a juicer, you know that they're not a cheap item. So this is the Philips Quick Clean something something Drip Stop Viva Collection. Quick Clean technology juiced directly into your glass. Drip Stop spout up to one and a half liters in one go. See-through pulp container. And I am so excited for this. I have been wanting a juicer for so long. I just, we haven't really had the space for it and then I didn't want to spend the money on it and just like which one to pick and all of that. So just getting one for uh, Christmas is perfect. And I've been wanting to do a juice cleanse. So if you want me to do a video on how uh, doing a three day juice cleanse, leave a comment down below and I'll probably do it anyway, but I want to see if any of you actually want to see that video. And uh, this also has like recipes and tips and stuff like that, which is great. So excited for this, and I don't have the name of it. It's the Philips Viva Collection Juicer HR1835-00, and it's 400 watts. I don't know if that means anything to anybody. Uh, we got some smaller items. I got a book. The title translated is uh, The Godfather, and uh, this is about a general secretary for FN, is that UN? United Nations about Trigvarlija, who was a Norwegian general secretary. I love like history and st stuff like that, so I'm really interested to read that and see what it's like once I finish um, the Song of Fire and Ice. We got this mug. This is like a sangria mug. If you've ever been to Spain or somewhere southern where they make like a red wine sangria or white wine sangria, and uh, you always get them in this these big jugs if you buy them by the jug. And I've been wanting one of these for so long, and now I got one, and this is huge. So we're going to be using this on New Year's Eve for sure to make drinks in. Not necessarily sangria, but something nice and tropical in this. And then we can also, we we're planning on making some um, aloe vera, which is a sour drink. To, and then we're also going to be making something tropical in this for people who either want to alternate or people who just like something sweet and fruity. We got a bottle of Tropica Sex on the Beach and uh, this is going in the fridge and this is also going to be had on New Year's Eve. We're going to be 10 people here so it's going to be 
pretty crowded, but it's gonna be great. And then we're going to make like food and everything, so it's gonna be nice. And then we got these two shots. So we only filled up one because we didn't have enough vodka for both of these. Um, this is the Sex on the Beach shot, and you just there's like candy in the bottom here, like in this one. And then you just fill them up with vodka, and then you let them sit, and then you just flip them every now and then, and then you get a shot in there. So this is licorice flavor, and this, and this is Sex on the Beach as well. And we're really excited to see how these taste. This one in particular, because like pretty much everybody has had a licorice shot, but um, Sex on the Beach shot sounds really interesting. And we got this super soft blanket. It has this like soft, fuzzy, wooly inside. It's not wool, but it feels like it. And it's so soft. Coral fleece, uh, fleece blanket with a Sherpa backside. So I guess it's the Sherpa is this kind of thing here. It's, it says that it's all polyester. Um, and I love blankets. And I think this color is really perfect for Christmas. I kind of want to bring some more red in here, but Mary's isn't the hugest fan of red, so getting red as presents is perfect. And we also got some decor items. So we got this little reindeer, which is so cute. It's this little golden little reindeer. So I'm, th I'm thinking he's gonna live here by our television. And um, he is adorable. And then I got these two little birdies. Um, and I think these were bought in Poland. This little baby bird and this bigger mama bird. And these are gonna have to live somewhere too, of course. So maybe they'll get to live outside when it's not winter. But for now, I'm gonna put them in the windowsill, I think. And then we got two of these containers. I have the other one right here. It's still wrapped in the paper so it doesn't shatter. Um, and it has this like splatter kind of thing on it. And uh, we can put like a big, big tea light in here. One of those like really big ones. And um, this is like a dark blue with the gold splatter. And if you have seen my apartment, I know I still haven't done an apartment tour. I, I'm getting there. With this gold, I think it goes really, really well with the rest of our place. Because we have a lot of gray and gold. And this dark blue just goes beautifully with everything. And then we have a few other things. And honestly, I'm not quite sure what this is called in English. Um, but you'll probably recognize the image here all right so apparently in english it's called dinner for one and it's a short black and white film and on in norway it always runs at nine o'clock on december 23rd i think in the rest of the world it runs on december 31st on new year's eve norway is weird and we run it on the 23rd so we always see that the day before christmas day which is again when we celebrate christmas i kind of wanted to do a get ready with me with telling you guys about like Norwegian Christmas traditions and everything like that but now we're like past Christmas and I feel it's a little bit too late so I'm probably gonna do that next year instead um, but we got some napkins which I l really like the the show it's really cool and then I'm not gonna open these but these are some matchsticks and um, I wasn't sure what this was so I had to open it but this is a candle so it has a wick in here, which should definitely be trimmed, and then it just has this image of the um, waiter going around uh, with Sophie in the background. And then we got napkins and coasters, and they say the same procedure as every year. So uh, we're definitely going to be using these on New Year's Eve for sure, because there's 10 in here, and there's going to be 10 on us, 10 of us. And then on the back, they just have these dots. And uh, we also got some cash, and uh, we decided that next year we're probably going to go on a cruise to the Caribbean with my mom and her boyfriend and maybe some other friends and family. So we're going to save every all of the money that we got for Christmas for that trip. So we set up a, a separate savings account just for that trip so we can save together. Did you get everything that you wanted for Christmas? Did you get anything super special? Let me know down below. This is great. I'm super excited. So I'm going to put all of this away and uh, I... Like I said, I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to give it a big like if you did. Leave any comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. And uh, yeah, you can find me on Instagram, Facebook, and Patreon at Crispy Black. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!